cars are as unimpressive as the Nissan Sentra. Though comfortable and roomy, its handling is subpar. The interior is bare, and the base model is extremely slow. The lowest output version has just 124 horsepower and comes with a fun sapping CVD. The SR Turbo at least addresses the power issue with the inclusion of a turbocharged 1.6 liter engine with 188 horsepower and 177 pound feet of torque. But it didn't keep this editor from picking the Sentra XR Turbo as his least favorite car of 2016. Still, the NIF Samba variant was on the way, and we still held on to a little hope that maybe, just maybe, Nissan's in-house performance division could make the little sedan enjoyable. And now that we finally got to drive one, we have an answer. It's still not good. In fact, with the CVT, it's actually rather bad. Yes, Nissan sent us its sportiest Sentra equipped with a CVT. We have no idea why because this transmission shouldn't be anywhere near the performance car. It may be acceptable for a lower trim model but it sucks out whatever life the 1.6-liter turbocharged four-cylinder has.